Hi, my name is Mbali Bengu. I from, I'm from Cape Town and I'm a marketing lecturer. Uh, I specialize in lecturing third years um, at the wonderful school called Red and Yellow Creative School of Business. And I also teach and uh, facilitate workplace learning, which is an internship program for the third years. So in a nutshell, that's what I do. What did I speak about today? I spoke about 10 ways in which my students have enabled me to be a better marketer. And of course, I gave some lecture insights and things that they say in the classroom, controversial things, and then I mesh that in with um, how marketers can use those insights to be better at what they do. So I can share sell the experience, which I think is probably a, a popular topic uh, in the context of marketing, but highly relevant. And I spoke about how the consumption of experiences as marketers holds far greater value than the consumption of products and services. So by that I mean that even in a lecture room, I understand the value that that session has for students. And if I don't create an ecosystem around that, a fun time, they're probably not going to come back. So the same sentiments that have been experienced in the lecture room, I have obviously brought it out into my businesses and into my marketing world. So there was attention as currency, and we all know that the consumer that we're faced with is currently suffering from marketing fatigue, overwhelmed with the number of messages. And so the same goes for me in the context of the lecture room, where if I do not get the attention of my students within 30 seconds, I've lost them. And so that's taught me that crafting communication that is relevant, authentic, relates back to how we can hold the gaze of the consumer, attention as currency. And then a last one, which was quite, uh, uh, I think, an interesting one, was, of course, ChatGPT, frenemy, question mark. Uh, you know, the younger generation is of the opinion that AI is an enabler. It's not actually the final product. And so this has challenged me to start understanding AI because I do feel backwards if, I, if I'm not using it because of them. That's the first thing. Second thing is how do I use it ethically? You know, in the world of academia, we look at things like that. Uh, but most importantly, not just academia, everywhere. How do we use AI ethically? How do we come to the party and say, yes, we have used it, we're acknowledging it, but it was not the final product. And then of course, how do we incorporate an element of humanness within the context of what we're doing with AI? So those are some of the, the top three challenges that I would say, or insights rather, that have challenged me and are still challenging me on how to be a great marketer.